Pandemics Pandemics are large-scale outbreaks of infectious diseases that spread rapidly across countries or continents. They usually occur when a new pathogen, like a virus, emerges with little to no human immunity, enabling swift and widespread transmission. Typically caused by novel viruses, e.g., influenza, coronaviruses, pandemics spread through human contact, respiratory droplets, and surfaces. Global travel and trade further accelerate their reach. Pandemics can overwhelm healthcare systems, disrupt economies, and cause widespread illness and death. Effective responses involve early detection, rapid containment, vaccination, and public health measures like social distancing and quarantine. Key strategies include improving global health infrastructure, monitoring emerging diseases, investing in vaccines, and promoting public health education. Coordinated global efforts are vital for managing and mitigating future pandemics. Historical examples Antonine Plague, 165 to 180 AD likely caused by smallpox or measles, this plague devastated the Roman Empire. Justinian Plague, 541 to 542 AD killed up to 25 million people in the Byzantine Empire. Black Death, 14th century caused by Yersinia pestis, it killed an estimated 75 to 200 million people in Europe, Asia, and Africa. Third cholera pandemic, 1852 to 1860 spread globally, killing over a million people. 1918 Spanish flu infected about one-third of the world's population, causing approximately 50 million deaths. HIV AIDS pandemic, 1980s present has caused millions of deaths worldwide and continues to impact many regions. 2009 H1N1 influenza affected millions globally, though with a lower mortality rate compared to previous pandemics. COVID-19 pandemic, 2019 present caused by the SARS-CoV-2 virus, it has led to millions of deaths and significant global disruption. Blizzards, blizzards form when cold air, moisture, and strong winds converge. With winds of at least 35 miles per hour and visibility reduced to less than a quarter mile, these storms can paralyze entire regions. Blizzards can block roads, cause power outages, and damage buildings. The extreme cold and low visibility can lead to frostbite and hypothermia. To stay safe, stock up on food, water, and medications. Stay indoors during the storm, keep warm clothing handy, and have an emergency kit ready with flashlights and batteries. Preparation and caution are key to weathering these severe winter storms. Notable examples Great Blizzard of 1888, winter storm that pummeled the Atlantic coast of the United States, from the Chesapeake Bay to Maine, in March 1888. The blizzard caused more than $20 million in property damage in New York City alone and killed more than 400 people, including about 100 sailors, across the eastern seaboard. The northeastern United States blizzard of 1978 was a massive and historic storm that hit New England, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and the New York City area. It started on February 5 and ended on February 7. Known as a Storm Larry in Connecticut, it brought heavy snow and severe weather. Boston got a record 27.1 inches of snow, and Providence saw 27.6 inches, also a record. Atlantic City had its highest snowfall ever with 20.1 inches, while Philadelphia suburbs got 20.2 inches, and the city itself received 16 inches. The blizzard caused major disruptions, with around 100 people killed and 4,500 injured. The damage was over $520 million, which is about $2.43 billion today. The 1993 storm of the century, also known as the 93 Superstorm, formed over the Gulf of Mexico on March 12, 1993. It brought cold weather, heavy snow, high winds, and storm surges from Canada to Honduras, dissipating on March 15. The storm caused heavy snowfall in the south, with Union County, Georgia, seeing 35 inches and Birmingham, Alabama, getting 13 inches. The Florida Panhandle saw up to a foot of snow and hurricane force winds, causing deadly storm surges and tornadoes. The storm led to record cold temperatures and power outages for over 10 million U.S. households, affecting 40% of the population. It resulted in 318 deaths and $5.5 billion in damages. The highest snowfall was 56 inches at Mount Leconte, Tennessee, and 50 inches at Mount Mitchell, North Carolina, with drifts up to 15 feet.